BGMC. The biblical truth lives here. We are living in the time like no other in history. But fortunately for us, God wrote it all down in His prophecies. Find out what prophecies happened this week ripped straight from the headlines. Stay tuned for the Prophecy Headlines News Show on The Remnant's Call. The Remnants Call End Time Prophecy News. Noticias de los últimos tiempos. The first uh, news story comes from Israel. La primera historia viene de Israel. Another beautiful thing in the land of Israel. Otra cosa bien hermosa de la tierra de Israel. Now listen to this, everybody. Escuchen right. esto. UNESCO says that the Temple Mount is not Israel. La UNESCO dice que el, el, tem, el monte del templo no es Israel. In the past. En el pasado, Jews were not able to go up to the Temple Mount and pray. Los judíos no se les ha permitido ir al monte del templo y orar. But because of what the UN did, pero por la por la causa de lo que hizo la Israel la UN, has relaxed the rules. Israel cambió las reglas. So 3,000 Jews over the holy days went up to the Temple Mount and prayed. Más de más de 300 judíos pudieron subir y adorar en el monte del templo. So Israel is saying <laughs> to the UN. <laughs> mm. They're letting the Jews pray for the first time in 70, almost 70 years. Ellos dejaron de, eh, permitieron los judíos ir y subir y adorar eh, really, por, actually, por 70 años. Really actually it's been in 2,000 no sé si. years. Y eso eh, se hizo por 2,000 años. Se retuvo. So they were at The Jews were able to take out a talit. Ellos fueron permitidos llevar sus talit. And wrap it around themselves on top of the Temple Mount. Y orar con sus talit. First time in 2,000 years. Por primera vez en 2,000 años. Amen. Next story. Israel, you know, those Jews are just trying to bless the world. Ustedes saben, esos judíos siempre quieren bendecir el, el mundo. They've almost come up with an, a vaccination for HIV. Ellos casi vinieron con una vacuna en contra del HIV. It's 97% effective. Es un 97% eh, efectivo. Now, H, how do you get HIV? Entonces, ¿cómo te con, contraes HIV? How do you get HIV? ¿Cómo te contraes el HIV? When you don't follow the Torah. Cuando no sigues la Might Torah. Might be that. Might be that. Just, just let it go. Just ride it. Okay. Um, HIV you can only get from unprotected sex. El HIV solamente te puedes contagiar con, eh, cuando eh, tienes relaciones And sin protección. IV drug usage. Y, y también los, las personas que usan drogas. Okay. When you're doing things against the laws of God, that's how you get HIV. Cuando haces cosas contra la ley de Dios es cuando te, contra, te contagias del HIV. There's an occasional medical professional who gets HIV. Hay una, también una, una mala práctica eh, médica cuando eh, puedes hacer que te contagies. But contraigas. that's because they weren't following the standard operating procedures. Pero eso es cuando no están siguiendo los requerimientos necesarios. All right, so Israel has come up with a, uh, scientists in Israel have come up with a, a, a vaccination for HIV. Así que esos científicos estuvieron eh, cerca de, del 100% de la vacuna contra el HIV. For the first time in 2,600 years, por primera vez en, en 2,600 años, they have found artifacts from the second temple. Ha, hallaron a, artefactos del segundo templo. Uh, uh, sorry, the first temple. Eh, artefactos del primer templo, perdón. They uh, were doing some archaeology and they found some artifacts from the first temple. Allí estuvieron haciendo unas excavaciones arqueológicas y encontraron eh, artefactos del primer templo. Which also proves that, once again, it's Israel's land. Eh, es, es lo que prueba este, que es la tierra de Israel, Jerusalén. Next slide. Antisemitism. There's been a lot of that this week. En esta semana hubo muchas eh, acciones antisemitistas. Here in the first story. Aquí en la primera historia. That picture is a picture of a side view mirror. Esa es la fotografía de un eh, retrovisor de carro. An Israeli was searching for a part for his car. Eh, un israelita estuvo eh, 
observando para estacionar su carro. And he uh, found the part in England. Y estuvo estacionando allá en Inglaterra. He found the part in England. Y, le, y, y, bus, y, en, y, y encontró eh, estacionamiento en su carro. Una parte para su carro. Ok. O oh, una parte del, del carro yeah. en Inglaterra. The, the mirror for his car. El, and okay. when the person in England y esa persona allá en Inglaterra found out that it was an Israeli wanting to buy the parts cuando esa persona en Inglaterra descubrió que era eh, israelita que quería comprar la parte del carro he refused to ship it to Israel él se rehusó en enviarla hacia Israel because he's an anti-Semitic Muslim porque es un musulmán eh, antisemita and then, he, then, he, then after saying okay I'll ship it to you y después de decirle que sí que se lo iba a enviar Okay, it was originally $48. Eh, originalmente era $84. The guy said, I'll ship it to you for $1,200. Y él dijo que se lo iba a enviar por $1,250. Eh, Next anti-Semitic story. On a Jewish school in Montgomery County, Maryland. Eh, una escuela eh, judía en Montgomery. This week came out to find swastikas on their school. Allá en Maryland encontraron eh, dibujos de suásticas. The antisemitism is growing worldwide, everybody. El antisemitismo está creciendo a nivel mundial. In our third antisemitism story, hmm? there were some Israelis that wanted to go to Germany for a, a, a holiday. Eh, hay muchos judíos que quieren ir a Alemania para los, sus fiestas. And they wanted to go to this guest house in Germany. Y quieren ir a estas, a estas casas de de esa residencia para las para las fiestas. They booked their vacation in Germany. Ellos registraron sus vacaciones allá en Alemania. And when the the per, when the the Germans found out they were Israelis, y cuando los alemanes se, eh, se descubrieron que eran israelíes, they refused to accept the reservation. Ellos se rehusaron de hacer las reservaciones para ellos. How would you like the Israelis to do that? ¿Cómo te gustaría que los israelitas hicieran oh, eso? You're just a, you're just a Nazi, so we're not going to accept you. Eres un Nazi, un Nazi, entonces no te vamos a aceptar. All right? So they can't, the, the, um, the vacation house canceled the Israelis' reservation. Entonces estas casas vacacionales de Alemania cancelaron eh, las reservaciones para los israelitas. Next story. Uh, end time prophecy news. Please pay attention. There's a lot of stuff going on. Noticias de arrancado de los encabezados. In Deuteronomy chapter 6, verse 7. Deuteronomio 6, verso 7. It says, teach your children at home. Dice que le enseñes a los niños en casa. This report this week. Ese reporte en esta semana. There are now 1.8 million families homeschooling their children. Ahora hay 1.8 millones de estadounidenses enseñando en casa. This has doubled since 1999. Esto duplicó el número desde 1999. Eso representa al 3.4% de los norteamericanos estudiando en casa. Going on to the next story. In Proverbs 22, verse 15. En Proverbios 22, 22, 15. The Lord says to spank your children el Señor when dice, they need it. El Señor dice que puedes corregir al niño cuando lo necesites. Deuteronomy, uh, it's Proverbs chapter 22, verse 15. Eh, puedes leer 20, Proverbios 22, 15. My mother would say. Mi madre diría. <laughs> You're crying. Estás llorando. <laughs> Now you have something to cry about. Ahora sí tienes algo de qué llorar. Okay. There is this very silly thing called ADHD. Hay algo muy eh, ridículo que se llama eh, ADHD. ADHD is only found in America. ADHD, H, eh, ADHD solo se encuentra en América. See, the French have one thing, well, they have two things, right? They make good champagne. Los franceses tienen dos cosas, bueno, dos cosas que son they buenas. They make hacen some very buenas, good wine. Hacen buen vino y buena champaña. Croissants. French fries. <laughs> and they spank their children. Ellos tienen esas cosas buenas. Hacen champaña, hacen vino, hacen croissant. En Francia, hacen, hacen they only have a 3.5% children taking any ADHD, ADHD drugs. Allá tienen eh, 
un porcentaje bien bajo, 3.5% de niños solamente que How toman did our a, parents? ADHD. Why, why, why wasn't there ADHD back in the 1900s? <laughs> Why wasn't why didn't we have the back then guys? ¿Por qué no teníamos esta, estos medicamentos en tiempo atrás? Can anybody say chicle? I mean chancla? ¿Alguien puede decir chanclas? Right? Did your parents get the chancla out? Si tus padres sacaban las chanclas, ya Or, no eso. As my dad when, when when my mother said wait till your father gets home. Así como mi madre decía, espera que tu padre regrese a casa. Then the belt was coming. Entonces la correa salía al aire. Because we had gone past the wooden spoon. Porque después de eso pasaban a la... What did you get? The metal part of the belt. Oof. Huh? I think we should use the baseball bat. <laughs> All right. So in, in France they don't have this problem because they spank their children. Y allá en Francia no tienen ese problema de utilizar medicamentos para los niños porque ellos corrigen a sus hijos. God says it won't kill the child. El Señor dice que no, no era para matar a los hijos. So we follow God. Sino que seguimos a Dios. John 17, verse 14, in the next story. En la próxima historia, Juan 17, 14. The Lord said, you're going to be hated for following my words. El Señor dice, serás odiado por seguir mis palabras. In this uh, new story. En esta nueva historia. The disgusting piece of garbage in the White House called Obama. La basura este, que está en la Casa Blanca And llamado he is Obama. Garbage. Y sí, es una basura. He stands for the gay people. Ellos están parando a favor de los, de los homosexuales. He says now if you're a religious organization Dice que ahora si eres una organización religiosa that preaches against homosexuality, que predica en contra de la homosexualidad you cannot help the government with aid to uh, when there's a disaster. No puedes ayudar al gobierno cuando hay un desastre. Yes, that's what the, the, the homo Obama said. Sí, eso fue lo que el homosexual de Obama dijo. He says if you do not allow homosexuals, if you preach against homosexuality, dice que si no aceptas y, y predicas en contra de la homosexualidad, because you're not equal. Dice que no eres igual. Well, <laughs> all right, we'll just help our own then. Entonces, We don't need your help, Obama. No necesitamos su ayuda. We Obama. can't wait till you're gone. No podemos esperar hasta que salgas. You have been the worst president ever. Ha sido el peor presidente de todos los tiempos. In Isaiah 5 verse 20, en Isaías 5:20, it says, "In the end of days, evil will be called good, and good will be called evil." Dice que al final de los tiempos lo lo malo iba a ser llamado bueno y lo bueno malo. In this next new story, en esta nueva historia, in a Virginia public high school, en la escuela pública de Virginia, they're starting plan a Planned Parenthood group. Hay un grupo de eh, planificación paterna. This is good in a high school. Dicen que eso es bueno en las escuelas. Okay, that is absolutely disgusting. Esto es eh, absolutamente desagradable. Yes, this is how you go get an abortion. Así que enseñan cómo hacerse abortos. This is how you murder your children. Así es como asesinas a tus hijos. Um, abortion is murder. El aborto es, es, es asesinato. Okay, my mother was looking for an abortion, but she couldn't find it because it was 19... <laughs> Mi madre estuvo buscando cómo abortarme, pero ella no pudo. It wasn't porque, legal back then. En aquel entonces era ilegal. Okay. Having a Planned Parenthood at a public high school is not appropriate. No es apropiado tener este, planificación eh, de nacimiento en, en las escuelas. How about letting the kids focus on mathematics and science and reading, since most of them can't do that? ¿Por qué no mejor enfocarse en cómo leer en matemáticas y en ciencias? Porque mucho, la mayoría de ellos no saben hacer eso. Going on to the next part. Mm -hmm. In the end of days, evil will be called good and good will be called evil. Al final de los tiempos, lo bueno iba a ser llamado malo y lo malo bueno. The, of the Syrian refugees, los refugiados sirios, more than 13,000 have come to the United States. Más de, de, de 13,000 eh, han venido a los Estados Unidos. 99.1% of the refugees are Muslim. 99.1% de los refugiados son musulmanes. Okay. 0.5% 0.5% are the Christians. Son cristianos. Who's being murdered in Syria? ¿Quiénes han sido asesinados en Siria? The Christians. Los cristianos. The Muslims are not being murdered unless they're fighting for an opposition team. Los musulmanes no son asesinados a menos que ellos estén peleando en un equipo contrario. Next news story. 
Here in 2 Timothy chapter 2, en 2 en Timoteo 4, 3, chapter 4, en el capítulo 4, verse 3, versículo 3, Paul writes, there's a time coming where people will not listen to the sound doctrine. El Pablo habla de, de que vendrán tiempos donde muchos no quieran escuchar sana doctrina. In this new story, there's, these are two idiots, I mean two pastors. Aquí en esa historia, estos son de dos idiotas, de que diga dos pastores. They're on a show called HGTV. Que ellos se, se, eh, se están haciendo un programa en HGTV. Okay. Um, the, the pastorette, the woman there, and the guy doing the devil sign. La pastora ahí el, y el sujeto que está haciendo. You know that's a sign of the devil? Señales satánicas. Okay. If you do this, si that in sign esto, language is why. Ahí en el, en el lenguaje de seña es, es. Es Y o Y o la. Ok. That in sign language is I love you. Y eso es en, en, en mudo es eh, te amo. Ok. That in sign language eso is es, nothing. Eso en lenguaje de señas no es nada. It's a sign of the devil. Es la señal satánica. So what diablo. do you see the pastor doing? ¿Y qué, estás, qué estás viendo que el pastor está haciendo? Ok. He's doing the sign of the devil. Está haciendo esta señal satánica. These two Texas pastors... Estos dos pastores de Texas uh, are saying that homosexuality is okay in the Bible. Están diciendo que la homosexualidad es correcta en la Biblia. They must not have read the book of Romans chapter 1. Ellos no han leído el, el, el libro de Romanos en capítulo 1. They uno. must not have read Leviticus 18 verse 22. Tampoco han leído Levíticos 22, 18. And Revelation, 18, 22. And Revelation chapter 22 verse 15. Y Revelaciones Apocalipsis 22, 15. Is homosexuality a sin? Yes. La homosexualidad es un pecado, sí. They're not going to get into heaven. Ellos no van a entrar al cielo. Nor is there somebody who's fornicating or stealing. Tampoco una persona que está fornicando o está robando. Or somebody who's taking drugs. O alguien que está usando drogas. Okay? If you're smoking pot, you're not getting into heaven. Si estás fumando marihuana, no vas a entrar al cielo. Will it help my appetite? Eso Go ayuda. to a bakery, it'll help your appetite. Eso ayuda a mi apetito. Right? Right. Go buy a bakery that just made some bread. Mm -mm. Mm. You go to a put near, near a Portuguese bakery. Ooh. Oh, when they just made some fresh bread, or or a pizza parlor. You don't need pot. You just need to be able to cook. Man. Okay. Going on to the next story. Una próxima historia. Once again, good will be called evil and evil will be called good. Una vez más, lo, lo bueno iba a ser llamado malo y lo malo bueno. Oh, this was from last week. Forgot to take it out. Uh, going on to the next one, Proverbs 8. En Proverbios 8. In verse 35. El versículo 35. In 36, people that love death. Y en el versículo 36, las personas amaran la muerte. And in Washington, D.C., that is apparent. Y eso es, son los padres en Washington, D.C. In eso, Washington, D.C. Eso es algo aparte en Washington, D.C. Esto es lo que aparenta hacer en Washington. Okay. They passed the Death with Dignity Act. Ellos han pasado la, uh, la, el, acto de, el acto de la muerte con dignidad. If you're terminally ill. Si estás con una enfermedad de, de, de terminal. Uh -huh. They now can kill you. Ahora pueden ya asesinarte. So, you know, Abuelita, let's, let's get rid of her. O por ejemplo, abuelita, ya vamos a deshacernos de ella. It's a seventh uh, area to allow euthanasia in our nation. Es en siete áreas ya que se, se aprobó la eutanasia en la nación. God calls that murder. El Señor le llama eso asesinato. Deuteronomy 28, verse 37. Deuteronomio 28, 37. God said, if you don't follow my rules, I'm going to make you poor. El Señor dice que si no sigues mis reglas, Él te va a hacer pobre. In New York City... En el estado de Nueva York. They have the highest level of homeless people ever now. En la ciudad de Nueva York tiene la cantidad mayor de indigentes en la calle ahora. They're up to 60,000 homeless people in New York City. Ahora mismo hay más de eh, 60,000 eh, indigentes en la calle. That is up 200 from, last, from the last two weeks. Eso aumentó unos 200 de las eh, dos semanas atrás. So God said, you don't want to follow my rules, okay. Señor dice, no quiere seguir mis reglas, está bien. Next story. War Noticias. stories. Noticias de guerra. Please pay attention to what's going on here. Por favor, preste atención de lo que está ocurriendo ahora. Yeshua said in Matthew 24, verse 7. Yeshua dice en Mateo 24, 7. A nation will fight against nation, people will fight against people. There you go, there's a couple right there. Dice que pueblo eh, contra pueblo y nación contra nación. Okay. 
The Turkish military deploys tanks on their border with Iraq. Los, la milicia turca está eh, poniendo tanques en, en, las, en las fronteras con ira, iraní. Okay. Iraqi. They're getting ready with war with Iraq. Ya están listos para la guerra con los con Irak. Next war story. The Russians are going to nuke Norway. Los rusos, los eh, Rusia está yendo a Norway. Vladimir Putin said this week. Vladimir Putin dijo esta semana. That because they allowed 330 U.S. Marines. De porque ellos permitieron a 330 eh, marines de Estados Unidos. In Norway, we're eh, going to nuke you if we go to war. En Norway, ellos iban a, a nuke. Ellos iban a, a lanzar una, nunca, una bomba nuclear en contra de ellos. Next war story. La próxima noticia. The Russian uh, nuclear submarines were spotted in the Irish Sea. Las, la submarino nuclear de, de Rusia estuvo en el, el, en, mar, en el mar de Irlandia. Irish, sí, Irish Sea. En el, sí, amén. Ok. All right, and last news story. La próxima noticia, la última noticia. Lebanon is about to go to war with Israel. El Líbano está dispuesto a ir a la guerra con Israel. Their new president. El nuevo presidente. Said we're going to take back the Golan Heights. Dijo que iban a volver a tomar el salto de Golan. He is a, uh, he's affiliated with Hamas. Es afiliado a Hamas. Okay, so he says we're going to war with Israel when he takes power. Él dijo que cuando tomara posición del poder iba a ir en contra de eh, hacer guerra con Israel. Get ready, everybody. Things are about to happen. Alístense todo el mundo. Esto está a punto de acontecer. That's it for the news stories. Ya esto es todo de las noticias. There were 192 of you out there last week. Semana pasada hubo 192 Only a few of you donated. Hit the daggone donate button. Solo un poco si ustedes donaron, por favor, presiona el botón de donar. All right, those of us who are here, if you want to donate... Que ellos están aquí si quieren donar. You want to keep your congregation open? Si quieres mantener tu congregación abierta. You like abierta. worshiping here? Te gusta adorar like aquí. hearing the news and the word of God? Escuchando las noticias y la palabra de Dios. All right, Dios. so we're going to take up a time and all. Shalom. My name is Messianic Rabbi Andrew Dinnerman, and I invite you to come to visit our congregation. If you are in the tri-state area, come out and visit with us on Shabbat. We are a congregation of Jews and Gentiles, living as one in the Messiah Yeshua. BGMC is a place of true worship. The focus never wanders from the Hebraic roots of our faith. Beth Goyim is rooted in the Word of God from Bereshit through to the book of Revelation. Messiah's strong words against man-made tradition are carefully recorded in Matthew 7. That is the reason we only follow the straight-up instructions found in Scripture, truly the way, the truth, and the life. If you're looking for a deeper walk with Adonai, come out for our Tuesday evening Bible study called Messianic Torah Time. Come, spend the day with us on any Shabbat. We start at 11 a.m. with the sound of the ancient Hebrew shofar. Next, we offer our King praise and worship in English, Hebrew, and Spanish. After worship, we review the headlines in the previous week's news from around the globe, especially news from the Holy Land, Israel. We don't just list the news headlines as current events, but we comb through the scriptures searching for clues to understand what they mean and then to help pinpoint prophetically our current position on Adonai's clock. After digesting all that modern information, we leave the world behind as we journey with our Adonai deep into his eternal word not with just one or two scriptures, but usually seven or more scriptures. The spiritual nourishment and the richness of his kingdom become accessible to the ones who share this special time and seek them out. The day does not end there. Because Shabbat is so special to him, there is always so much more that our king desires to share. So instead of separating and leaving, we stay together as a family for potluck lunch and an afternoon study of our King's Word. We close the Shabbat together with the reading of the New Week's parasha. That's the Torah portion. Even after those blessings, many of us just can't get enough. So the members bring prepared homemade foods to share while we all enjoy 
an uplifting movie together. If all that information is not quite enough, you can check out our website where you will find over 200 video teachings and biblical Holy Day studies. Under Messianic Torah Time, the Hebrew Roots button, you'll discover free studies on many, many different topics, including PowerPoint slide presentations. If Beth Goyim sounds like a place you'd love to visit, but you live outside the tri-state area, there is still a way to connect with us. We stream live on the internet on Tuesday, Thursday, and Shabbat. The website is www.bethgoyim.org. That's B-E-T-H-G-O-Y-I-M.org. Our phone number is 973-338-7800 or 978-2-YESHUA. That's 978, the number 2, YESHUA. Shalom.